The M8 Buford light tank was created by FMC as part of the Airborne Gun System AGS, initiative. This program aimed to develop a lightweight tank that could be airdropped for use by airborne troops, intended to replace the M551A1 Sheridan. The first prototype of the XM8 was constructed in 1985. The XM8 was chosen as the winner of the Armored Gun System program and was later renamed the M8 in 1996. Regrettably, the entire Armored Gun System program was terminated in 1996, preventing the M8 Buford from entering service with the U.S. Army, which resulted in a lack of significant firepower for airborne forces. As of 2019, the tank was still being proposed to potential customers. The M8 Buford features a combination of aluminum and steel armor, with the option to add modular titanium armor, including explosive reactive armor ERA, kits if required. The front armor, when supplemented with these packages, provides protection against 30mm armor-piercing rounds. The M8 Buford is designed as a relatively thinly armored vehicle, meant to provide infantry support from covered positions and engage in combat scenarios where it wouldn't encounter main battle tanks. Equipped with either a fully stabilized M68A1 105mm rifled gun or a Rainmetal XM35 gun with an autoloader and fire control system, the M8 Buford's fire control system resembles that of the M1A2 Abrams main battle tank. The autoloader can hold 19 to 21 rounds and achieve a maximum firing rate of 12 rounds per minute. Extra projectiles are stored near the driver, and manual loading is possible in emergencies. Trials revealed that the ammunition compartment struggled to contain ammunition reactions when struck by anti-tank weapons. The secondary armament includes a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun and a roof-mounted 12.7mm heavy machine gun. The crew of the M8 Buford comprises three members, a commander, gunner, and driver. Powering the vehicle is a Detroit Diesel 6V921A turbocharged diesel engine. The M8 Buford can be airdropped from aircraft such as the C-130 Transport, one vehicle, C-141, two vehicles, C-17, three vehicles, and C-5, five vehicles. The XM8's chassis was also intended to serve as the basis for the Lozat line-of-sight anti-tank missile system. A similar design was the British BFM-5 light tank, developed by Vickers, which was based on the XM8. The VFM-5 was a simplified version of the XM8 intended for export customers, though it didn't receive any production orders. In 2015, BAE Systems unveiled an updated M8 version, smaller and lighter, to meet a US Army requirement for a new light tank. However, in 2022, BAE's proposal was excluded from the Mobile Protected Firepower program in favor of the Griffin II, developed by General Dynamics. Although the M8 light tank continues to be proposed to various customers, it has yet to receive any production orders.